we're going to uh, uh, do a reaction video about uh, you know paubaya by uh, Moira. Ito yung original na komanta niya ang si Moira de la Torre. Tapos ni revive ni Stephanie uh, de Maranan. But uh, we're going to find out. We have not seen this video yet, and we don't have any clue what is this all about. Last time, ano ba yung pin in natin? I forgot the, uh, um, something. Uh, I forgot. But we review um, uh, Stephanie's uh, uh, music video last uh, week ago, and uh, we got a lot of views. And we're just going to do another one, and hopefully this time we'll be able to. Uh, uh, give every action uh, well enough because we already know some other people saying that oh because you didn't know the other guy is a mannequin that's a reason but we don't know we're just kind of like playing this uh, video and we don't have any clue what we're going to do is just going to uh, make a uh, reaction and we're not professional singers and also we're not a professional uh, voice coach we're just going to uh, make a reaction or give a reaction based on what we see and it is only a personal opinion so don't be embarrassed at the same time uh, insulted right how about you Atifiana what can you say do you have any idea what is this paubaya mm -mm. how about I, you Ito uh, I, no. well I just know it's a cover by Zephany how about you Atiriel come closer here um, okay it's probably about singing about singing okay <laughs> let's start okay we're going to start now the video so It's not recorded. Yeah, uh, Paubaya by Stephanie. Uh, you, you can tell easily the, the music is a little bit sad. And you can tell sa face niya, she's sad. So maybe the uh, the concept or the message of this song is maybe sad. But we're going to find out. It's moody. What can you say about her voice this time? <laughs> At the start when she was singing, I thought her mouth went, went like this. I think like, yeah. her voice is matured. That's matured. what I think. Matured. Kind of sounds like what maybe. What? What do you think? I can tell she's very skilled at singing and her voice is, her voice is matured. Okay. How about you, Ito? What do you think her voice? Remember last time you said this, her voice is like an auto-tune? What do you think about now? Well, they, they're kind of using a little bit of auto-tune right <laughs> Well, now. because when you don't know the behind the scenes, when I'm filming, they don't actually sing. When they shoot the music video, they have to lip sync to it say. because there's like a already recorded, I think, um, maybe a recorded, uh, the recorded of the song, and then they have to do like a music video like that. Okay. So it's not really auto-tune. I think masyadong ini-emphasize na yung mga ano yung mga words and sometimes it's hard to understand Ito, sa aking opinion this is only my opinion I think the the phrasing is a bit uh uh it's not exactly on the tune and it's like bang, bang, like that i think uh this is only my personal opinion when she's singing the phrasing but her voice is really good but the phrasing part yung parang kinakat yung mga lyrics parang hindi akma sa ano sa melody Yeah, I've noticed 
when she's singing, just, uh, parang lumalabas sa ano, nasal, nasal ang the thing. So, I don't know, probably she's trying to, uh, to copy yung original na si Moira de la Torre. Pero usually, ang boses ni, ni Stephanie, parang hindi ganyan, di ba? It's just kind of like very sweet, uh, sweet voice. But this time, she sounds like a, uh, an, Grown up or adults. Ito, what are you doing? Let's pay attention. Napangiti, pero uh, she's not smiling. <laughs> I feel like yeah. she's like running out of it. She's like, <laughs> yeah. I think it's not really. I can't stop. I can't <laughs> but again, her voice is read. good. Parang hindi yata nagkonek yung when she nakangiti. Era nakagano siya dapat nakangiti. Tapos balik ko sa facial expression. <laughs> Now, what do you think about that? Even though you don't understand Tagalog, what do you think the message? Um, I think probably she... Her heart tried, got broken. She try, I don't... i just guessing she tries to be happy, but maybe her emotions don't, like, you know, show, show mm-hmm. up about, like, sh- what she wants to express uh, through her emotions, but I don't know. Yeah, I can. think the same but thing. But I don't know. It's just really I think guess. the same thing, but I think I she's trying to smile like, 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 come on, you can have her. Well, so, I mean, it's a I, slow, I feel like it's, it's a, a. She got. She was heartbroken, and then she tries to smile all the time, but she can't because she sees the guy. Yeah, and it's a slow tempo, tempoed um, tempo. song. Tempo I mean, song. It's a, it's yeah. a tempoed song. Sorry. I will find out what's uh will be the uh, the whole uh, uh, message of this song. Even myself, I uh, trying to uh, you know analyze it, but I know she's in pain. Probably she she's a. Uh, broken-hearted person but well we didn't know the in- entire story yet <laughs> pronunciation i don't know probably because i'm not used to yung parang very uh, uh, parang parang hinahagod yung mga ano yung mga lyrics the message it's it's hard parang ah uh, i i want to enunciate more of the uh, the lyrics so that i can understand so when i when she's singing I'm trying to get it, but my uh, my mind is somewhere. So probably I couldn't focus because of the uh, the song, uh-huh. but I'm sure there is a good message. But uh, mm-hmm. I know there's a uh, broken hearted or there's a pain in the song. Wait, Dad. Well, okay, what what? Well, maybe because the way she pronounces it's probably because, uh, uh, while writing, um, maybe. She wants to be in character, maybe with the with the song. I don't know. Probably reflect on the emotions. So probably that's why. Okay. But I don't know if this. Yeah, you might be right. That's the reason. Sometimes we're in pain. It just kind of. Like, sometimes you cannot say or enunciate the words. But you know, I'm. I don't know. Probably I'm auditory type of person. When I want to to hear it and trying to listen, I couldn't get it. But I think, yeah, maybe that's the character that she's playing on this music. (gasps) 
that's another thing when we are reacting to a video that we don't have any clue at all this is the first time we uh, we've seen this uh, music video totally i don't know what's going on and i'm sure you will understand why we're reacting this way but if we've seen this before or watched this video before 100% we know what is what will be the flow of this music what will be the mood of this music but so far we just getting a few bits of it like the mood that she's uh, portraying that she's on pain like she's sad things like that but who knows we might get the total uh, uh, story or the whole story of this uh, song Pay attention she probably the girlfriend and then she found out that her boyfriend has somebody told you yeah told so you. wait wait her boyfriend is cheating on her told you. <laughs> that's sad that's the reason why probably she's in pain and the way she yeah. sing that song she's so emotional <laughs> Okay, she's saying that when she's embracing or hugging her boyfriend, she 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 can feel it that the guy Doesn't is like thinking it. somebody else because she couldn't feel the warmth of that guy's uh, arms. So that's how I interpret this song. <laughs> she figure her out that her uh, boyfriend has somebody else and then she's saying that okay if you really uh you know love that person i'm not gonna stop you and i'm not going to force myself to you wait i need to say something how about what, what are you going to say Ethan? the cameraman's movie the camera a lot i can't i can't really see her face <laughs> well it's it's the movie. <laughs> well, oh it's more on the uh, cinematography well that's another thing it's kind of like you, 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 you notice that she's the main focus of the uh the camera no background she's just sitting and then singing right well uh -huh. there's another uh, genre and like the one that we uh uh, call this uh, reacted last time there is a good interior I'm house in yeah probably this uh, music video is a low budget uh, music video it's only uh, a shot inside the uh, studio or maybe in a room with lights and then different that uh, they uh, played with the lights to look like a uh, uh, I call this uh, dramatic or mellow or sorrowful <laughs> She, where is she uh, sending this message saying that don't worry I'm going to tell her that please don't uh, let him cry or don't hurt him so I don't know why she's she's saying that to, to a girl because he wants her um, she wants him to be happy with her mm, okay how about you Ati Fiona maybe as long as he, she wants maybe her she wants him her boyfriend to be happy and maybe that's what she needs i don't know okay yeah, see you agree with me how about you right. ito how about you I ito agree. agree with me okay well <laughs> you know what there's no such thing as wrong or correct uh you know feedback uh, reaction i don't know here. because it's I more of a personal how you feeling. interpret the song even me i might uh you know be be wrong i might be correct but there's no such thing as a exact uh, uh 
correct answer for this one because we, we're just kind of like interpreting her song and remember song is like a poem right <laughs> saying that I realize that uh, even though I'm the, your first but still you pick the last one um, is she that, gonna kill him no oh. we don't know but oh. she's saying that so probably she's saying that uh, you know that's that's the way love is you know sometimes it work out sometimes it's not you know even though you're the first one uh, he loves you or you love him is still it's not a guarantee that you're gonna be stay together for a long time <laughs> uh, you can tell her now look at her eyes she's feeling it now she's crying you know, theory eyes she's almost gonna cry so it means that she's feeling the song yeah. No, but she's doing. She's she's pouring water in her eyes. Well, I mean, no. they cut it. And they might then... have um, eye drops to make her do that. Well, no, she has can... to fit in character either yeah. way. With the she's song. portraying a character when she's singing this, and you can tell. You know, uh, probably that's the reason why she's not really enunciating it well before when she's uh, uh, saying the or you know singing the lyric because she's in pain right and now you can tell that she's sad she realized that the reason why she uh, he picked her probably she she found he found something uh different in terms of probably uh in her in the girl in the yeah girl. look at the, the behavior or probably the personality or the she, chemistry because he was kind of bored of her so he probably wanted he wanted to see another girl it's like how about you, Ati Fiona? Well, maybe the boyfriend lost lost their con uh, lost his connection, like what he used to, you know, when he actually felt love with with his original girl girlfriend, and so I guess uh, the second girlfriend, that's where he uh, started his connection with the other girl, and felt love towards that per that girl. Okay. <laughs> That's the reason why the title is Paubaya, okay? Mean? Meaning, I'm just leaving uh, you to her, you know? I'm just, you know, uh, not going to hold you back, okay? Just giving you, I'm giving you freedom to, to pick and choose between me and the other girl. So, in return, she say, she's saying that you are free. I'm not going to stop you you're free to go so you can go with her so that's the reason why the title is paubaya actually the paubaya is a very uh called this uh, deep tagalog uh, words you know it's hard to translate paubaya you can use a different uh usage in a sentence so the closest uh, meaning for that for me is to not give. to give up but you give that person open-heartedly with no calms with no uh call this uh reservation so that's the meaning um, of paubaya with daddy, daddy, yes it could probably have like a isn't it isn't it called connotation or denotation like to the word yeah 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 it's, it, it, it it depends on how you use yeah. it in in a sentence okay. yeah you're giving it away 
paubaya. You're giving it away it's in a positive way, positive so way. that you 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 maintain that kind of good relationship, not to uh to hold back or uh, call this what's a uh, grudge in it. What do you call that? To have a grudge. Yeah, to have a grudge for that person. You're just giving him uh, freedom. Pina. to you yeah i'll give him to her yeah that is a very tough uh call this situation especially if you love someone or if you love somebody that you thought that person is love you as well but all of a sudden you found out that that person loves someone else and of course because you love that person you're giving him freedom to go to that person because you love him. It's like that saying, if you really love them, you should let them go or yeah. something. Like uh, Barbara Streisand. Yeah. Let me go. No, uh, Barbara Streisand. Uh, when you love someone, you let him free, right? You let him mm -hmm. free and yeah, then be definitely. with that person. So I think that's the, you know, I think that is the message that uh, we uh, heard and seen in this uh music video uh, the title is paubaya by zeppani and actually the original uh, singer no, for this by one Zephanie. yeah no the the original na uh, uh, called this uh, singer who sang this song is uh, moira de la torre and zeppani is only the yeah that's the cover. why that's why it's a cover oh it already yeah. ended not yet not yet didn't why am i looking backwards okay well that's all I think, uh, did you uh, stop it? No. No, not yet. Okay. Okay, I think that's all. So thank you so much. Okay, say thank you. Thank you very much for watching a reaction video. We'll see you soon.